All right, let's see how this goes. Not a great first lap, but it's all good. We got more. All right. Let's hope this lap's better. I think it will be. All right, let's go.
we like. Way better. All right, heading back to the car. Let's go. Ooh, a little wobbly. Ooh. Nice. Somewhat flowy, a little controlled. So today's ride, you know, pretty good. I had new components on my bike, I had a new tire uh, on the rear. Never tried this kind of tire before, so, you know, had to get used to it, which I should have taken into consideration on that first lap, uh, especially considering how crowded it was, you know, how many hikers and bikers I ran into. Um, and then for second lap NASCAR, that lap felt pretty good, pretty solid. Uh, on Strava, I basically tied my PRs throughout that whole trail. So, you know, pretty decent, felt pretty solid. Uh, you know, it was flowing nicely and cornering well, except for a few iffy moments, but overall, you know, pretty good ride today. Okay, so I've taken like a minute to rest. So my brain's working a little better and I realized I didn't really actually mention anything I did well or poorly specifically, which isn't all that useful. Um, so some specific things about the ride. Uh, I noticed on NASCAR, 
uh, I need to work on opening up my corners more so that with the, the arc I'm taking, I can carry more speed through. Because, um, you know, the more, the wider the arc is, generally the more speed you can carry through to a certain extent. It's generally the rule of thumb. And then through that triple drop section, um, I wasn't looking up a whole lot and I got offline. And in the video, looking back on it, it ends up looking fine, but um, I definitely went slower than I could have because I got just, I wasn't keeping my head up enough. I was looking at my front wheel, which is, you know, you should never do that. Um, so opening up corners, you know, taking a wider arc when possible. Um, and then as always keeping your head up, you know, looking ahead on the trail. So those are my specific takeaways from today's ride uh, and what I'm going to try to work on in the next one. So thanks for watching.